So given that fact that a majority in this recent poll said a third party or multiple parties are necessary, could YouTube please change the page to reflect that so at least we can have some fairness somewhere within the media system? There's no legitimate reason why it would be structured this way if you want to represent the rights of the majority of American people. Like I said, I believe there's many Americans who will be voting for either Obama or Romney and still think Americans have a right to know that that's not their only choices. I think most people are fair-minded. So that's the question. Why can't YouTube do this? Add the other campaign ads for the other parties. Change the way it's structured so it doesn't misrepresent what the American people's choices are. Now you might think what I'm asking is so reasonable that YouTube will just do it if it's pointed out to them, but that's not the track record. You had Mike Gravel who was running as a Democrat and was in the debates on stage with the other Democrats. First off, understand that this war was lost the day that George Bush invaded Iraq on a fraudulent basis. Understand that. Where's the money coming from? It's coming from Wall Street. Look at Obama. Seven, uh, what is it? Sixty-seven percent of his money comes from five hundred dollars or more, and he's trying to let you believe that it's coming from the kids. Hillary Clinton, eighty-nine percent of her money, five hundred dollars or more, comes from where? Wall Street. Here, seventy-three percent Edwards. What do you think that they're buying? This is Wall Street that finances the insurance companies, that finances the pharmaceuticals, finances the military industrial complex. Obama wants to have more soldiers. And he's pleading with the political director of YouTube, could you please list me as one of the Democrats in the primary? Hi, my name is Senator Mike Gravel, and I want to address this particularly to Steve Grove, who I hold in high esteem. Steve, we've met before. But I do want to lodge an official complaint. Apparently, I've been uh, relegated to a footnote at YouTube. And, of course, we do get a lot of stuff on YouTube, and I don't think I deserve to be a footnote. I'm one of three candidates uh, in the presidential race, Obama, Hillary, and myself. And uh, I am a candidate. I have not withdrawn. And uh, I can understand that mainline media uh, making a footnote out of me because they don't particularly like my message. But I do know that the people on YouTube do like and enjoy my message because I get a lot of reactions to that. And I think you do too, Steve. So I appreciate if you would take away my footnote and elevate me to the status uh, that I think I deserve, and that's full status as a presidential candidate. Thank you uh, for your attention, Steve, and I hope you can make this correction. Thank you. But it wasn't changed. And at the point he's asking this ad reduced it to a footnote, and now it, the footnote's not even there. I want you to be aware that there is a track record of how YouTube has covered politics and the elections in our country. So perhaps if we're more visible, if we're more vocal, maybe this video can be featured by YouTube. Featuring this video would be a step to informing the American people and YouTube viewers of their political rights. Political rights are important enough that I thought, you know what, I should be talking about this in the next video. So I'm asking these candidates, and there are others, see the links in the video description. And I'll put a link in the video description to this poll. 